Welcome to Good Mythical More. We're going to be giving a movie or a television show, and, and um, then we got to figure out what is the best food and drink snack beverage combo to have with that viewing experience. Food and drink snack. But first, who you talking about? We're going to read a comment that one of you may try to figure out who was it about. Who was it about? Discordia says, it's unfortunate that Blank's box joke didn't get the attention it deserved. Best line in the episode. Box joke. Box. I saw, I saw the answer, I can't, I can't participate. Oh really? Yeah. Was it referring to a box? It, it flashed up as on the screen. A, uh, you know. I cannot tell a lie. I saw what goes in the blank. Well, Blank's me, box joke. Let me look at you and decide whether or not you saw that it was you or me. So what is it? What is the drink? What is that? That's tang. Just, that's this just. Is, this is tang, man. Get you some tang. But now what you're doing is you're referencing something that we did just for the society, for people who may not be in the society, which is really smart that you did that on purpose. Right. Because what we discovered is a new way to share the drink, and we had a tang moment. And that's only available in the society. Yeah, we did an extra round. Go over there and I, check I, it out. I didn't even I didn't Mythical even know society. we were gonna do, do a promo. That was pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. Since you're in a promo mood, I think it was probably you that made that box joke. Nope, it wasn't me, and it wasn't you. It was Steve. Who else is gonna make a box joke? Let's see it. Well, I'd already seen it. <laughs> it's unfortunate that Stevie's box joke didn't I mean, get I've been oh. told I'm really good with boxes. Oh, dang, Stevie! Well, hold on. Was it a joke? Was it a joke? Well, you know, yeah, it was one of those. I don't like. I don't like this. It was true. I don't like it's watching. The best watching comedy this. comes from a what place a of joke? truth. Stand, stand by your statement, Stevie. Well, like I do. I, say. I do. <laughs> like when I lived it, and and it was out there. My children's children will remember this day forever. Can you do my voice, Stevie, when I hold it up? What are the chances? I want to hear Stevie's best me, me impersonation. My children. <laughs> That's good. That's good. My children's children will remember this day forever. I feel like it's a little Abraham Lincoln -y too. Hey, I, I'll take it. I'll take it. That was good. <clears throat> All right, give it. Give us a. Give us a, a something that we're watching. Okay, we're gonna start off easy here. The Lord of the Rings. You can really put yourself in that chair. This is nine hours of content. Now let's just back assume. To back. Well, let's assume that we're watching the first something one and we're watching wanna, it. You don't want to something. You don't want to get the runs. That's true. Because if you got to keep pausing that thing to take a run of the runs, you will never. Are get we through it. at the theater? Or are we at home? I think this is something that will constipate you. I think at this point you're at home because what's these a, movies are yeah, rat. only home watch. What what's a what what do you eat when you need to firm it up? When you really want to constipate cheese. it out. Cheese? The cheesiest snack. I think maybe just a block of cheese. I think maybe you're just doing straight cheddar aged <laughs> like a Tillamook. Just a big block Tillamook? of Tillamook. N and no drink. <laughs> I, no drinks. So, so He's with me on the constipation. It's basically Tillamook block of cheddar cheese and air to drink. <laughs> and that's what you're going to do when you're watching Lord of the Rings. Uh, I could eat a whole block of Tillamook. I, I mean, could. you have nine hours to do it. Yeah. I, I'll, I'll start nibbling on a block of cheddar sometimes. <laughs> Time will pass, and I'll, it'll be down to a third, maybe, a third of that block. Speaking of cheesy snacks. Um, like a mouse. Lando was sick recently and I was trying to be a good dad and I was like, I'm going to the grocery store, I'm gonna get you some trying. things you feel like you can eat. Um, what do you want? He was like, uh, cause he was like nauseous. I was like, well, he said goldfish. And he was like, you know what? What's that? You, he was like, you tried all the goldfish, what's the best flavor of goldfish? Ooh. Get me that flavor. Oh. And then I was like, uh, well, you watched that episode much more recently than I remember doing it, so you tell me. I couldn't remember. And he was like, there's the blasted ones. I was like, yeah, the blasted ones. He was like, get me the blasted cheddar. I think that's the one that won, and he remembered. And then I went out and I got it, and I was a good dad, and I ate half of them, because uh, I was right, and you were right. Yeah, yeah they're very they're good. They're really good. But it might have been a little too cheesy for a sick boy. A little blasted. Well, you know what? If you're sick, you get the blasted. 
Okay, so air and a block of cheese is what we've decided. Or bla- blasted goldfish. Oh, okay. That was an entry. Yeah. Uh, Jeopardy. Oh, Jeopardy. This is quick. So you can definitely get diarrhea for this one. Yeah, you can You can get the squirts. What's going to give you the squir- unapologetic well, squirts? What gives you the most squirts of any? This is chili. This, this is, is chili is time? really, really hot chili. Really, really spicy. You know what I like to eat when I watch Jeopardy? Really hot chili. Really, really greasy chili. Spicy chili. The kind of chili that the fat has just like floated to the top. Woo-wee. And you just get you a big... You can see your reflection <laughs> in it. Yeah, you just... Mirror, mirror yeah. on my chili. <laughs> and you don't have to drink anything because the chili's so Who's going to have the squirts before? It's just back, wet, guys. fatty chili and Jeopardy all night long. Who, who's who's every, on Every Jeopardy commercial now. break, you just... Like, you just risky go going to the bathroom. Is it Maya? Is she doing it? Well, she's one of the hosts. But you know, like I always say, Steve. History <laughs> is written by the victors. Eat it, loser. <laughs> wow. <laughs> she's gone full. I think you should be, I mean, to be authentic, you need to be a little more Southern than that. <laughs> what happened to, Eat what, it, happened, losers. what happened to the deep gruff? What happened to the deep gruff? I mean, you get one thing at a time. You focus on one thing in your, in your impersonation at a time. I'm trying to think, what makes it ooze out? Ooze? Just ooze on out. I mean, a chili will do it for me. I don't. I don't. I just. I don't. I don't get the diarrhea that often. I don't think I. I don't. You I, get I can't trigger more. it. You get constipated more. Yeah. I yeah. don't ever get constipated really. I'll get constipated. <clears throat> The opposite problem. Um, Sometimes it's both. Okay. Have you ever had both? It's like a cork and then... Yeah, yeah if you uncork it. <laughs> yeah, that's the worst, man. That's the worst, when you got a cork. <laughs> look, 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 look. KG, she can't get enough of bathroom humor. We're just doing scoop, it for you. Scoop, scoop. <laughs> <laughs> glug 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 glug. Yeah, yeah, it's the worst. Man. It's it's chilly for me. Uh, it's the chilly for me. Uh, it's Mayim and who else on Jeopardy nowadays? Ken Jennings. Oh, okay. They haven't. They did a thing. Uh, they did a thing where they did the um, the Masters, the best ever. I saw it. I didn't watch it. I don't know if it's already happened or I, I just saw it and I was like, oh, it took them like fifty years to come up with that idea to like get the best to all be against each other. They'd never done that? I don't think so. I don't think so. Are you asking about the hosting? Because it just depends on who's hosting, and, and that's when you're going to eat the um, wet fat we chili? Only, we, we, yeah, we eat the wet fat chili when Mayim's hosting. We do not watch the Ken Jennings version. <laughs> how often do, does it, how do they switch? Is it alternate days? or It's questions by question. Like, do you Every, know? Like two months <laughs> is what David said. It's a two month stint. So, how, how, how many episodes do you think they. How long does it take to shoot two months worth of Jeopardy? How quickly do you think they do that? A couple weeks. A couple weeks. They, they shoot six episodes of Wheel of Fortune in one day, David said. Oh, wow. So, they probably do the same thing for Jeopardy. Because you watch. David, when you were on Wheel of Fortune, you watched the other episodes, right? No, David can only talk to me. <laughs> Yes, I did. You were in the audience? I was, yeah. And this was um, post-COVID, pre-audience era. So all the other contestants were the audience for that. Oh, you make friends? But <laughs> answer really, the question. No. You didn't make any friends. They were much older than I was. Really? He was there for the money. Didn't you see? You see how much money he didn't win? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I didn't see that. Let's see it. Today, Good. you all witnessed greatness. You're welcome. Don't look at yourself. I'm looking at the words so I can mouth what she Don't says. Don't do That's cheating. Well, that's more fun. No, it's not. That's too easy. What, is it a game? Listen. What's the next situation? Unless you start thinking of life as a game, you're going to lose. Yeah. American Psycho. Ooh, okay. What is this now? <laughs> you've seen, you've seen many clips from this. It's a series, right? You, it's a movie with Christian Bale. You've seen. Oh, many, when he was like the machinist. No, 
No, it's not that. <laughs> he plays a. Uh, he was real skinny. He in plays that. a day trader, right? Is that right? Like the thing about Christian Bale is his mouth. Wall, Wall Street guy. And I know you cast Batman for the mouth because that's all you can see. And I think that's the only time it's worked. It's like, I'm just not comfortable with that man's mouth. <laughs> Something about how his face just goes into his mouth, but there's no, it's not like there's no lips. What are you talking about? I don't think Christian Bale has lips. Bring up a picture. I think he just has face and a hole. I don't think he has lips. I think he's got, I think he might even have average lips. And the way that he holds his mouth, I don't know. He doesn't seem like a happy person. I mean, he's no Ben Affleck, but he doesn't seem happy. He's so intense. And it's that mouth. Well, he's a, he's a very talented actor. He's a very talented actor. Uh, and American Psycho is a, is a pretty intense movie. Um, it's a good movie, but it might, I mean, it's not like, when you hear American Psycho, you think it's gonna be like a killer, killer movie. But what is it? Uh, I don't really remember the plot, because it's literally been 20 years um, since I saw it. Could, it could upset your tummy. But it's got, it's got oh, some, uh, It makes you nauseous? It's got like a yeah. bathroom sink scene. What, what happens in that? Doesn't somebody's... Head get uh, he he doesn't have lips. I'm looking at pictures of him now. Well, I think Google it's, it on your own time. I think it's his lips are a very similar color to his face, but they're there. He just needs a lip liner to show him. So anyway, while you're watching this, I think um, just in case you get. Is lips. it? There's some unsettling scenes, right? That's what I'm saying. You, you could, you could. So this is about know. coming out the other end. So you want a saltine? You want uh, something to set? You want a, co a little coke you, and some saltines? No, you want something that when you do vomit, it won't bother you. You know okay. what I'm saying? So it won't, it won't sting what about as bad. Overnight oats. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Now you're talking. Yeah. Overnight oats. And I don't know if you knew this, but those can ferment because I got drunk off a. Of Vat of overnight oats just well, a couple of days well, ago. How many overnights did you? They, it was put in? my container was really puffy, and I was like, "Let's just go for it." And then it was real sour. And you kept eating it. I didn't eat all of it. I'm just joking. You know me. Okay. Beware. So beware the fermented overnight oats. So fermented overnight oats, but I think you probably need a drink for this one. Put it. Put it'll put it'll put it'll put um. What's it put on your ribs? Put meat on your bones. It'll stick to your ribs. And I like a good chia pudding too. I bet that's gonna be pleasant coming back up. No, no, the seeds go, no, 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 you don't want that. The seeds, those go chia everywhere. seeds get into your nasal passages and never get out. Oh, gosh. You have no. like a chia pet coming out of your nose. Now you're thinking, I have one of those anyway. <laughs> um, what would you drink, what do you drink with overnight oats? Um, I think probably just a latte, you know, because it's just a morning time when you have them. Because you're gonna watch this in the morning. I only watch, I only watch Wall Street movies in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> I only eat overnight oats in the afternoon, actually. Well, that makes sense. I don't eat it for breakfast. I eat it as like a filling snack. Yeah, you don't like eat them when they're ready after they've been overnight. <laughs> you wait until the afternoon. <laughs> and they, yeah, and maybe that's well, why they're fermented. They fermented. <laughs> Okay, you know what I always say. I'm a winner. See my prize? You're a loser who sits and cries. Ha 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 ha! See, you still did good. Yeah, yeah, I did. And good. you're getting better too, Stevie. It sounded more and more like me. All right, let's see. Overnight oats for American Psycho. Um. Okay, what do we want to land on here? How about Tiger King? So, remember Tiger King? Took the world by storm. Because because nothing else was happening. It was the pandemic. Everyone was talking about it. It was that that was a good little series. I mean, it was it was unbelievable tossing tossing and turning and revelations and then they tried then they milked it dry. I think you want to eat something that makes you feel like you could be there with him in his place in Florida. I don't think he's there anymore. No, no, 
when you are watching it. Yeah. He's in jail. You're talking about tiger jerky? No, no, no. I mean, like, what would he, what would, what, Joe, Joe Exotic. What would Joe Exotic? Joe Exotic, eat? Um, probably a little Miller Genuine Draft. Does he, is he eating anything in any of those scenes? Can you just search Joe Exotic eating? Uh, see if he, there's any eating footage. Surely he ate something on camera. Uh, what is this what? wasted meat? Wasted meat. Yeah, 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 yeah. What is he eating there? Okay. He, he oh, did, yeah, yeah. He the did Joe a Exotic pizza, pizza commercial. He did a pizza commercial. You eat pizza while you watch Joe Exotic yeah, do you his can, Tiger You can King eat King. anything you want. You can eat like... Um, anything in that picture, you can eat it. So you can basically have the pizza or any of the drinks. Is there Yoohoo back there? I believe there's Yoohoo. Yoohoo sounds good. Yoohoo and pizza. Yoohoo and pizza, that's it. Yeah. Then you feel right at home. Yoohoo and pizza, you, me, and pizza. <laughs> Why is there, it's interesting, Joe Exotic Burger. Yeah. Well, I'm looking at these things that are coming up. and Is this, somebody like named a, a dish after Joe Exotic? Is that what they were trying to do? Well, there's a place called In Skip Grill. And they named a burger after Joe Exotic, and it's the whole thing looks deep fried. It looks awful. It looks awful. That picture looks awful. But the season one's really good. Season two, he's kind of in prison the whole time, so it's not as good. Yeah, I, I didn't watch that one. Yeah, but I didn't watch. You know what before. I was thinking the whole time. Avoid eye contact with me, like I'm Ellen. Unleash your legendary style with our line of mythical grooming and personal care products, available now at mythical.com.